Did you know that scientists have actually reconstructed the last day of the Cretaceous in detail using geological evidence? Today, we're going to bring it back to life. CO2 levels were four times higher than today. Temperatures hit plus 25 degrees Celsius even in the Arctic. Perfect conditions for giants. In those greenhouse conditions, unique social structures evolved. Unlike most modern reptiles, Triceratops lived in complex, organized herds. And those famous horns? Scientists still can't agree. Were they fearsome weapons against T-Rex or elaborate mating signals? Recent studies show that a lot of theropods actually had feathers. And yeah, T-Rex didn't run. He walked at about 12 miles per hour, but his bite packed over 6,000 pounds per square inch of pressure. The Chicxulub asteroid was about six miles across. Its impact released roughly 100 teratons of TNT. The blast wave wiped out everything within a 930 miles radius. The impact triggered mega tsunamis over 100 meters high and set off global wildfires. The planet fell into an impact winter that lasted for years. But that's what allowed mammals to take over the empty ecological niches. Sometimes the end of one era is just what it takes for another to begin. Leave a like if you appreciate the science that pieces together Earth's history bit by bit.